Chapter 5, The Ethereal. The glistening waters of the Alunian Ocean embrace the pristine shores of Sunilua, Nae, whispering a lullaby to Akio, a young woman entwined in a bond with a woman of weak complexion from a distant land, possessing a symphony of languages used in her study of Akio's tribe. Under the tutelage of this enigmatic figure, Akio discovered the art of deciphering written and spoken words of foreign languages and immersed herself in the woman's enchanting tales of Cleopatra, a regal sovereign of the desert pyramids. In her reveries, Akio envisioned a meaning to the shared stories of the Desert Queen and began adorning her tresses with intricate braids and her eyes with the smoky depth of charcoal. When time for the foreign land woman arrived to bid farewell, the men of Akio's kin abruptly shrouded Akio in a cloak of baseless accusations, alleging she had stolen the foreign woman's garments. These accusations were fueled by insidious envy. They seeped into the fabric of their souls, threatened by Akio's bond with the weak complexion stranger. Akio's indomitable spirit was tormented by a searing inquiry. How could the men condemn her so unjustly? Despite her fervent attempts, at elucidation, the walls of tradition stood resolute against the tide of reason. Just as the sun was glaring in the middle of the sky, Akira bore witness to the procession of female captives, a succession of caravans destined for perpetual misery, never to return to the realm of hope. Akio became bound and encaged among the detritus of her fellow captives. She languished, her elongated limbs cloaked in a tapestry of a deep, resilient complexion. All were ensnared in the inexorable march towards a protracted, excruciating demise deemed unforgivable by men. In defiance of the impending agony that awaited her, Keo unleashed her voice in a resounding melody, a symphony of love and defiance cascading from the depths of her soul. As the spectre of death drew near, Akio locked eyes with her persecutor, her gaze unyielding in its fearless resolve. Unflinching in the face of mortality, Akio knew her destination. Her gaze remained unwavering as she beheld the visage of death itself. She embraced her final dance with life, a testament to her unwavering spirit amidst the encroaching shadows with a smile graced upon her lips.